Okay, hold on. U W A S D to move. Hold shift to run. Hold left mouse to display the cursor. Release left mouse to interact. Press right mouse to examine inventory. Press T to skip certain dialogue. Press escape to toggle this menu. This game saves automatically when you exit. Take your time and explore. Huh. What did you say his name was? Oh, I gotta. And he didn't. Oh. Is he bringing the boat back for us? Of course not. Right. Of course not. Hmm. It's lonely here. We're used to loneliness. Right? I am. I don't know about you. Come on. I have no friends and everyone thinks I'm a weirdo. Story of my life. <laughs> That's part of a being adolescent. Ooh. Loneliness is growing up and listening to your bar- wait, listing? Oh, and listing your barber as an emergency contact. Okay, Mr. Dra Dramatic. It's talking to people who won't answer. Hey, Phil. Do you have to kiss my eyeballs better? Probably. That would be helpful, Phil. It's talking to people who won't answer. And it's suspecting that Travis Spickle wasn't actually crazy. Who's Travis Pickle? Never mind. Huh. Um, oh, okay. Is this the, the ocean? It is. You don't actually want to kill me. What? Already we're a hostage? Yes, I do. What? No, you don't. You haven't thrown me in front of a bus. You haven't had me stab myself. Or shoot myself. You ever had me jump off a cliff? Or into a lake? Or anything like that? You've just been dragging me around to places like this. <laughs> Gross ice ears. Thank you for your help, Phil. I mean, what are you hoping to find? I'm hoping to find whoever poked those people full of holes and left them in a pile. Wow, that's what happened? We both see through the same pair of eyeballs. We read the same article. What? This Quentin just in my head. Just because you make me look at something doesn't mean I pay attention to it. And also, just because they found some bodies here doesn't mean a psycho murderer is hanging around. I don't know, maybe. This doesn't make any sense. And besides, you can just make me stab myself if it's death by stabbing you're after. It makes sense to me, and that's what matters. I'm looking for something I'll be satisfied with. Like old age? You're young. I have time. At least let me have a cigarette. I am dying for a cigarette, Quentin. Yeah, spicy supper. No! <laughs> Philip, no, that's even worse. I would have thought after three months you'd be over that. Well, I'm not. Isn't lung cancer a sufficiently horrible way to die? Ooh, there's a, another house over there. Let's just go- Well, just go away. Let me smoke, and in 30 or 40 years, I'll die of lung cancer. You'll get your revenge, and I don't have someone else controlling my body for the rest of my life. Girls your age shouldn't smoke, Kaylee. Well, girls my age shouldn't be puppeted by vengeful ghosts, either. Ooh, it's, it's a goose. Hey! Shoo, shoo, shoo. Okay, finally. That's a open door, yes. Hey, there's me. What's cobwebs? They're camp beds. Hmm? You remember when you paid to send me to summer camp? They had these beds. Actually, the cabins looked a lot like this one too. Huh. Us. They're stuck to the dresser with rust. They must have been sitting here for a long time. Or they were just cheap crap. Does the price of tools really matter? Of course it matters. Okay. Secret Skullgirls. I mean... We could, yeah. But it would just be us.
Is this... Is this it? That's probably it, right? Ew! Just ew! Kumotted Phil. Oh god, this is weird. That's how you throw. Wait, hold on. Uh huh. How do I press right mouse to examine inventory? I don't want to throw. Well, I guess I'll throw it. When I could still, I could still unmod Phil though. It's going crazy. Barely no. <laughs> Why did you let him complete it? I don't think anyone's touched these in four decades. They're covered in dust. Sneezes. A uh, chew. Blech. Dust. This music, though. They've been stepped in recently. No, spooky. Um, your balls hurt. From what? They're so dirty I can't even see outside. Um, can I not? There's always no point here. Ew. No points. No points here. Your practice. I'm not good at fighting games, Phil. I don't play fighting games. There's no point. I all I do is button mash. No yokes. See so you no know, music or machines. That's true. From what I've heard, this is not a very long game. Wait, what's wait, what's run? Hold on, run something shift? Yeah, there we go. Now we're talking. an empty thing. Good. I mean, neither do you. What is this chapel? A church? A library? Wow, this makes me feel weird. It's just a rock with a strange symbol on it. Don't you feel it? Or, you don't feel it? I don't feel anything. Of course not, you're a ghost. What's this? Pick up. Throw. Hmm. It's not actually a door, just a concrete outline. I think it's part of a wall. Maybe there's not an entrance. One would assume so. Okay. What is this game? I don't know. Halloween simulator. <laughs> Wait, oh, do I have to like throw out the window? I guess not. Oop. What is this? What's the sign? It's pointing north. Yes. I have, no I have no idea how you do that. Well, I have a good sense of direction. You don't. Uh huh. Pick it up. Hey, Yeti. That, that did nothing. I was told there's another entrance here. Hmm. 
Maybe, maybe I just gotta wax stuff. Huh. Hey, Luna. Hey, Sephiroth. <laughs> uh, my eyes are just irritated right now. They're just, they're really dry. Well, no, that did nothing. There we go. I picked something up. I don't know what it is. I want to go in here. Oh, wait. What's that building? Another, another structure. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Come on. Nothing. Nothing. Hey, EX one one e <laughs> X E. Jesus. Wait, did I go over here already? Oh no, I haven't. Okay. Let's throw that. Looks like a generator. It's not running. No duh. It's locked. What? They're, they're extremely dusty. I can make out silhouettes. That's it. Some furniture, perhaps. Is that a person? No. My eyesight's better than yours. That's a person. Our eyesight's exactly the same. Actually, maybe it's a chair. Yeah, probably. <laughs> 101. No. I can't. I can't just call you 101. E101 Gamma. Wait, is it E101 Gamma? I don't know. I don't remember. It smells like stale air and old cigarettes. And I feel like something's watching us. Of course you do. Just a dry pile of rotten mush. I can't, I can't pick this up. Nothing's happening. Oh, okay. There's nothing of interest. Says you. Ooh. Oh god. Looks like the food has been in here for a long time. Years maybe. It smells awful. Okay. Huh. What am I I'm just throwing shit. There's Okay. Books Books on unexplained phenomena, urban legends, UFOs, and all all sorts of bizarre things. Any about ghosts? Several. How about poetry? You can see everything I can see. No, there aren't. Did you miss writing poetry? It wasn't poetry, and no, I don't. I've gotten over <laughs> that nonsense years ago. I snuck into your basement and read some. I thought it was good. I mean, it didn't rhyme, but whatever. Slap. Ow. Well, now you made me slap my own butt, perv. What? It's called a spanking. What? This game? It's about, it's what children get when they misbehave. Yeah, sure, that's the reason. What? Nothing. What? Why? 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 Okay, no, I already read that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't like the look of this. They're bullet holes. How can you tell? With all the target <laughs> shooting we did together, I'm surprised you can't tell. Hey, Steam. Christ. Uh-oh. There's a thingy over here. Oh, it's a thing? Breakers. Every one of them has been tripped. We'll untrip them. Instant rice, mashed potatoes, canned beans, all the stuff you used to eat. Yes, bachelor food. Huh. Okay. Now that is my kind of toolbox. Bleh. Tools. Nothing wrong with tools. Hey, there's a key. Nice. Don't touch it. What? The chainsaw. Why not? 
Come on, you know tools make me uncomfortable. And chainsaws are the worst. Bleh. Super icky. What? Who is this girl? They're covered in rust. Eating rusty nails is a horrible way to die, right? Why are you giving me suggestions? I don't know, it's fun. Interesting. Throwing some gears. Throwing some things. Read notes. My name is Roger. This is your kingdom. These are your rules. Rule number one. Your childhood was one of inferior, <laughs> inferior lies and inferior fairy tales. You have grown up. Rule number two. Remember the truth. There, There is no truth. Rule number three. Forget the truth. Reality is what you decree. Rule number four. You have books full of better lies and better fairy tales. Use them. Ugh. <laughs> These dogs. Hey, can you go over there, please? Jesus. Anyways, create, create your truth, creates happiness. Rule number five, you're a king, you're a god. Hey, I always want to be king. Rule number six, do not fear or trust the crackling whispers around the trees. Or among the trees. That's a weird way to spell among. You are more than equal to them. Phillips, your nemesis. What? How so? They look damp and rotten. The breaker's trips. Yes. Okay, so I got a key. And the key... Only if my door is locked. Oh god. This is a slow walk up the stairs. Oh wait, there's an upstairs. Right? Yeah, this is the upstairs. Ugh. Hey. Matthew 19. It's a page from the Bible over there. There's a grocery list. <laughs> wait, there's a grocery list is scrawled on it. Okay. It's covered in cigarette burns and food stains. Gross. Oh, hey, it's our favorite book. Sarcasm? Yeah. Sometimes it's hard to tell with you. It looks old and ragged. Huh. An old CRT television. Do you remember watching movies together? Of course I remember. That was only a few months ago. Do you miss it? In a sense, yes. Me too. Oh god. There's upstairs. More upstairs. Toothpaste. Several different kinds of toothpaste. Okay. Toothpaste. Oh, no, toothbrushes and pills. Need to use the toilet? Nope. Actually, there's no water in the bowl. Well, now I do. There are bushes outside. Yuck, it smells awful. You can remember it smells a lot. Wretches. Oh, good, I can throw this too. Nothing's happening. Can I throw this in here? No, I can't. Wow. Wait, is that. That toilet paper roll is too big. It's dry and stiff. Ugh, I'm feeling already nause nauseated by this. Oop. Lonely Maple's Campground. Was this like the attic or something? I hear them at night when it rains. Scratching, seeking men, cat-like men, gods like me. There's more electricity in the air since last week. Crackling. I feel the wind of another planet. I am Jesus. God is four. They whisper everywhere. I speak back, and they hear me. We teach each other. There is so much like me in spirits. The animals are gone too, except for the crows. Warm like breezing blowing. Or, breeze blowing. Sparkling waves. Empty island, always empty. My kingdom to my truth. When will they come? And I will greet them with bowed head or with bullets. I am Jesus. Well, that's interesting. Yep. Examine. Ooh, money. Oh. Oh, wow. That's a lot of money. Oh, wow. Probably tens of thousands of dollars. Oh. 
Wow. Take it. Hmm? Your money. Take it, Quentin. Let me have it. No. Please? You don't need it. So what? I don't want it. Or I want it. Come on. No. Holy fuck, Quentin. Let me have the money. Watch your temper. And watch your language. This is what gets you in trouble. God damn it, dogs. You don't, you don't get angry often enough to let, to know how to handle it. There are thousands of dollars, which you won't be needing. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Great. Yeah, this game, I don't... I don't know, I have it in my library. It's old and weathered and covered in dust. Seems it was outside for a long time. It's been up here a long time too. I think... One of my dogs is playing with the, uh, playing with my flip-flops, and now he's growling at my dog, my other dog. Old copper boxes, good. Hey, what's this? Open drawer. A lot of important papers. There's a map in, there's a map here that looks like it might be useful. Okay. It's locked. Um... Maintenance, bathroom. Okay, I guess that's where we're at right now. Can I? I guess not. Okay. This is, yeah, this is not where I want to go. Why is it locked? I wanna use this. I guess not, okay. I don't know, like all I know is that Quentin is like some ghost in Haley's body. I don't know. Okay, that's, that's the maintenance thing. There's bathroom, bathroom, shower. Actually, I don't know where I'm at right now. No, anyway, this place can't be too big. We're on some island. Just some rusty knives and spoons. It's filled with rainwater. Let me drink some. I'm thirsty. Seriously? Sure, it's just rainwater, and there's nothing wrong with rainwater. Sip. Bleh. Okay, that's actually really nasty. <laughs> Beyond Souls, too. Oh man, I still have to play Beyond. Or Beyond Two Souls. Cows aren't done. Yeah, they are. I still need to uh, play that game. The wood is still in relatively good, relatively good shape. I don't think it's been out here very long. We're actually in playing to my upcoming games. No, one I have to add. I have to actually own that game. Two now. Okay. Oh, this is bad. I'm already like feeling kind of gross and nauseated. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, this so this should be the place from the beginning, right? I I went through this place, right? Yes. Hey, Zuki. Ratchet and skink. We already been through here. Three yes, no. Four double no. No no.
Is this cabin two? I think that's this is cabin two. Because there's another thing right here. Should be cabin one. And then up ahead is should be a shower or something like that. <laughs> oh yeah, and I always feel nauseous when playing first person games, so like right now I'm okay, I guess. This is I don't know what this is. Why is this building here? And I already went through here. I couldn't get in. There's a concrete slab. Oh wait, is there a... What is that? Read plaque. Hollow we the four, the one. The glorious was in chapel. Hmm. Marsh the door, concrete outline, dig as part of the wall. Maybe there's another entrance. Well, we assume so. You don't have to see anything. See if there's another entrance then there has to be Looks relatively new. Unless this game is just tricking me. Saying circles, I assume them. This is the maintenance. Oh, that's odd. It's made out of copper and has oxidized yet. Thanks for the host, Zio. <laughs> Ibaka. Hey, Artemis. Thanks for those. It's shiny enough I can see your reflection. And do you like what you see? Oh, for God's sake. Stop. I don't want to have- Oh, oh okay. <laughs> I don't want to have sex with a 12-year-old girl. Diane hasn't changed that. Now I know we're 12 years old. Whoa, calm down. Jeez, I just wonder if you think I'm attractive. You would be attractive if you weren't a child. Now let's stop talking. Why do you always act like I'm asking for sex? I never asked you for sex. I'm not even sure how that would work. I only ever wanted to be friends. You're the one that's turned us into something weird. Haley, there's no way a 12 year old girl with and a lonely 30 year old man can be together alone every day without it turning into something weird. Especially when a girl keeps asking uncomfortable questions about how her body looks. Thanks for the host, Phil. Well, that was fun. Let's just see what's down this hatch. Christ. Zooks McGooks. Why? Why has Zooks McGooks been a boost? I'm I'm 13. What? You said I was 12. I'm 13. That's not even... Still, Haley. Oh, Luna Box in here? Yes. <laughs> you, you're a child. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. You talk like an adult. You're starting to look like an adult. Maybe sometimes you think like, you think like an adult, but you're a 12 year old girl, Haley. 13. Adults don't run to their daddies and lie about being molested when they can't handle rejection. Ooh. I'm sorry. I was angry. I wanted him to care for once. Well, good job. He cared enough to put a dozen bullets in me. Damn. What the hell? <laughs> what? What the hell? And now I'm dead. I'm never gonna have a wife. I'm never gonna have children. Any friendship we might have had died died with me. I don't believe that. You don't have to. That's just how life works. Hey, Trojan Man. Thanks. Thanks for the incoming hosts. You punch the hornet's nest, you get stung. This game, like, what? Okay. I see.
It's too heavy for me to lift. But I want to take it. And throw this chair. Can I... Can... yeah. Do you need to see this thing? Maybe. Well, let's find out. Well, I got a crowbar now. <laughs> Crow's babby. No, you're a babby. Hey, Mason. Uh, this is apparently about the game of a 30-year-old... <laughs> this is about a 34-year-old man inside of a 12-year-old girl. Ooh, all these notes. Pages of a survival newsletter. They're all quite old. It's stuck or locked. Uh, yes, I heard it was locked. What? Oh. Okay. There for the triple ukulele. So good. Dreams come true. <laughs> oh god. These boards look new. Yank. That's not gonna happen. Alright, later, Yeti. Why is it so loud? <laughs> Christ! Now there's music? Maybe there's something around we can use to break through them. Oh, that's scary. Is there a switch? There is a switch. Oh god. That scared me. Turn off music, put on auto DJ. An uncomfortable cot. It doesn't look like anyone's ever slept in it. I mean, I'll turn on auto DJ when I switch to Isaac, I guess. The rusty ladder, leading nowhere. Why would it be leading anything? I don't know. Okay, I'm. I don't want to be over here. I switch to Skullgirls. Hey, we're inside here. Those is. those do. Already, already, it sucks. For now, says Roger. Better we will be better. More to learn. Stories. Okay. This looks useful. All right. It's just illegible scribbles. He met a man, an eyeless man, a toothless man, and he looked at the man, and the man looked at him, and he saw the man was beloved and dearest of friends, and the man spoke to him, how long since you have tasted the bone marrow? And he told him, he told him truthfully, and the man said, come, and he went with the man, and they vomited pure cold clean water into the endless internal infinite sea. And then, the end. 
A story by We the Four the One. Blech. It's like an alien wrote it or something. <laughs> Observing we knowing. Soundings. Human making art. Instrument for data. Beauty and is cries of all. Yes, puncture for science. We music men for. We the four the one we have language. Writing to and the power to put in it. We are gods now, if ever we weren't. Gods and domains. Gods need domains. Unfractured domains. So we make another, a better one. A terrarium. Maybe we, they call it. Ask Roger. We call it kingdom. The greatest experiment yet. For humans go in and live. We're writing a tome, a sliver of wisdom. If we keep the father's beast away, or it will keep the water's beast away, uh, a glowing skyball will be our throne. A moon, maybe they call it. Ask Roger this too, and the skyball will be wisdom too. Kingdom will be kept alive. That name seems familiar. Roger? The article said someone named Roger Cox owns this place. And he's a recluse, right? You said you didn't read. You didn't read it. Why well, I made a read of it? Okay. Let's let's. Zero one zero one one one. The farm. The farm of pigs in smoke. Zero. Okay. Okay. Got it. I wonder who lit the candles. Tiger. What's going on here? Yes, I read this part. I read this part. I read that part. More to learn. Stories. Yes, yes, yes. Birdies Bay. Oh god. This is a weird puzzle. What do? Oh, turn lower. Oh, nothing. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's touch it. What? Ooh. That felt really weird. What the hell just happened? Jeez, it's hot. Yeah, it smells like rotten meat. I feel, and I feel floaty. Where are we? I have no idea. Mm, puts me this way, so. Oh, good. Let's run. Can we run? We can run. This kind of reminds me of. I guess killer is dead, sort of. For some reason. They look like skyscrapers, they aren't though. I'm 
Okay. Oop. Come on. What's this building here? From orange to red, yeah. What's this noise? Looks like a clock thing. Uh huh. There's nothing else. What's this? What's this? There's a thing here. Uh oh. Was that another thing for me to touch? No, I guess not. No, they're just weird things. Pick up. I guess not. Oh, come on. Oh, that was weird. Uh oh. Jesus. This is probably what the ritual boy was like. You. Oh wow. What the hell? Yeah, what the hell indeed. There's a fire in here. That's weird. What? It's ice cold. There's no hinge. They're just, they're just solid iron. Oh, weird. There's some books. No. Can't burn books. Looks like a bed, I suppose, but it's made out of concrete. Hey. What's this? Oh, what? Farmer pigs and smoke. Then the thorn forest to avoid the music machine. Ooh, okay. This is this is this it? The Republican debate for the lols. Oh Jesus. I wonder if I just go straight through here and it'll take me back. Maybe, hopefully. Oh, I guess not. This is the end. Maybe I should go over here. Banfield for what? <laughs> Zooks me cooks. Aw, poor Zooks. Philippe, don't uh, don't don't abuse your mom powers. Don't be like me. He's on hooks. Do you think that these are what you're looking for? They're sharp and pokey. No, I don't think. Wretches, what's wrong? It's small, awful. Like when you're covered in wretches and horseradish. I would, I would recommend not sniffing them then. Let's start somewhere else, please. Okay. The fence is made of iron, but it's covered in tiny scratches that look like wood grain. What is it, a doghouse? There's no door. So we have concrete, like everything else here. It's the sides of the shed. I don't hear anything barking inside. Well, it looks like a doghouse. It looks like a concrete shed. 
Maybe this is. I don't know. Guess. I don't know. You have no imagination. I know. God, this girl's kind of annoying. Oh. Is there a way to get through here? Perhaps. I don't know. It's too dark in there. I can't. Oh, Jesus. Okay, what's over here? What? Oh, good, <laughs> good lord. Pigs? I... Examine things. Is that blood? I think so. Just some ordinary kitchen eyes. Blah. Stop looking at it. It's making me feel sick. I mean, I guess. Examine sun. Oh, that's the sun. Well, that's the most unsettling sun I've ever seen. Oh, okay. Here we go. Tokus. Tokus. Okay, what's the thing here? The Thorn Forest one one. Okay. Snips. Oh, I mean, ow, ow, Quentin. The rain. What? Get inside. Hurry. Ow. Por qué? Why? Why get inside? Is our health terrible? Do we melt? Oh shit, I hear a heartbeat. Oh god, oh god, oh god. So much problem. The rain. It's hurting me. Is it acidic? No, it's... I don't know. I can't explain it. Alright, then back out we go. No! I can feel it. Killing me. Don't go back out there. You remember, you remember that I'm trying to kill you, right? Yeah, whatever. Don't go back out there. We can't stay here forever. Okay, fine. Just try to stay inside when you can. The pain's going away now. Not <laughs> now that we're not outside. Quentin, seriously, it hurts. Oh god. Oh god. I don't like this sound. Feels awful, Clinton. Bring me inside and let me have a break. Oh god, I'm gonna die here. Clinton, please. It hurts. We're inside now. Calm down. Whew. Smoke sacks? No. Come on. I am, I feel I've been in I am in a cold sweat. What is this? What am I? Oh, is that it? Um, oh, I have no idea what this is. No comment, Haley. My skin hurts. Huh? What are we? I mean, we're, we're over here now. <sighs> My 
so gross already. I thought this was supposed to take me back. Gotta go back, back to the past down where I jack. It should. Oh, wait, here we go. I missed it. Nothing here can kill me. Time or hunger or damage, nor will. Only the rain. The new world will be heaven, they say. Petting and poking me. Cooing, retching. Time will stand still, they say. Our children will have children. Will have children and prosper. Believe them. No, not now. Oops. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let me skip that. <laughs> Christ! Leave them, no, not now, not after my capture, not after the, the rain. They keep others somewhere. Other places, other cages. The others are strangers. I have not met them. Settle down. Their names. Mary, Jessica, and Hector. One for me, one for him, they say. Yeah, this game is bizarre. <laughs> That's That was big boy running around. Freaking going room to room. Now he's on my bed. How long have I been here? Don't know. Too long. Or not long. Cookie. Get over there. Or exactly as long as I deserve. Long enough, I taught them to write, damn it, to speak, to tell stories. A creature is under my building, my cage growling and whispering. Woodland te teeth, it says. Your friends, it says. Or says, listen, no, too many mistakes already. So many mistakes. Who am I? Now I know. <laughs> Flexing. Zicky C. Aww. Not Roger. Not Jesus. Not a king. Not a god. Not a truth crafter. I am Judas Iscariot. Oh, I mean, if you feel that way. The wood is incredibly soft and wet. It's moldy and rotting. No comment. My skin hurts. I guess there's nothing. Nothing else here, maybe? Hey, Fire Golem. Yeah, this is a weird fucking game. Die here, I know it. Oh. Okay, here we go. Are you okay now? Hey, Ethel. What kind of game? I don't know. We're, I guess, like exploration game. It's kind of missing machines. Jesus Christ. Let me touch it. Let me touch it. Uh, 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 uh. Are you back here? Oh, thank God. Okay. That was the second one, right? Or the first one? Oh, that was the Thorn Forest that came, so. One. The void now. Okay. Ooh, now it's back to red. Oh, it's a voice. I did not expect to see the likes of you. Did you hear that? Yes. I think it's coming from over there. Let's take a look then. It seems you have sailed off the map, girl. 
And here, there be dragons. Huh. Ask it where we are. What places, what places, what these places are. Who are you? I am many things. And I have many names. Right now, I am the voice emanating from the chair. You may call me Voice. And you are a girl. Far from humanity is a need home. This place, out of time and space and time, is no place for you. Ask it where we are, Haley. We are in a place, Quentin. Out of, time, out of space and time, Quentin. Good lord. Hmm. I sent someone with you. Inside you. Don't slap Ethel. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the rampage! <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, ignore him. He does not strike me as a spirit to be ignored. Well, he is. Just ask him where we are, Haley. Where are we? Um, voice. You're in a land of half dream hell hellscapes. Tell me, do you believe in God? No. No, we don't. Then you do not believe in devils either, and you will not believe where you are. Okay. Sigh. Ask her to tell you anyway. Tell me anyway. First, tell me your of your vengeful companion. I conflicted spirit, I sense. Spirit, who are you? Tell it I'm nobody. He's my imaginary friend. You imagine strange friends, girl. Yeah, well, he's not so bad once you get to know him. I see, and you are certain that you know him. Sure. Wounded animals are not to be trusted. You have one living inside you. Stop having the conversation and find out where we are, Haley. Do I presume to know your imaginary friend? And ask it what killed those people. Um, so yeah, where are we? There are many things in reality and outside reality, girl. Many places humans' eyes have never deciphered. Many beings human minds have never comprehended. This is such a place created by such beings. The Spindlemen. Who are they? Creatures of terrible in innocence. Terrible, terrible innocence. Once in a time beyond time, they were God's companions. They slept at his feet and listened to his words, and he showed them the ways of creation, for they could not understand them on their own. They were... They are fragile beings, capable of understanding only the literal, only the literal, not imagination, emotion, or beauty, only usefulness. That is what, that is how God created them, and with his help, they dutifully crafted beautiful worlds of childlike wonder. Forests of warm crimson, deserts of sparkling white, vast oceans of the deepest blue. They were his children, and they delighted in making a crown, making crayon drawings for him. But eventually, they became unsatisfied, and in their na naivete, they said, "We do not need your words or your wisdom." They said, "We are four, and we are one. We are the Spindlemen." They said, "We can create, we can analyze, and we can decipher the mysteries of creation ourselves." And thus, they left him. Tell it to get the point. To get to the point, this doesn't help us. Hey, you're the one that wanted it to explain where we are. I didn't ask for a Sunday school lesson. I don't remember hearing this in Sunday school. Hmm? Nothing. Keep going. Humans have always perplexed them. They, don't, they do not understand your ways because, as I said, they do not understand imagination, emotion, or beauty. To them, your stories are nonsense, your paintings are stains, and your music is noise. This place and the others like it are their attempts to replicate and understand your world. Seems I should look for these middlemen. So this is just supposed to be um, our world? Yes. But everything is really weird. Yes, until recently they can only observe you from afar. All they had were glimpses and impressions. But somehow they found a way in. Some crack in the wall. They made contact with one of you. They took his land for their own. And they have been modifying their creations. Building, always building. Building structures they presume to have purpose. Building that infernal machine. Infernal machine? What's that? It is their answer to the question, what are humans for? 
They deduce that you are complex noisemakers and they think themselves virtu virtuoso musicians. Because when your existence is a wasteland of, of quantifiable. Wait. What? Quantifiable? Values? Screaming is as good as singing. I think that's all we need. And this thing is starting to annoy me. Let's go. I guess I'm leaving now. My imaginary friend sucks at talking to people. Sorry. Nice meeting you, voice. The spindlemen are dangerous, you know. Wonderful. They're not malicious, but for all intents and purposes, they are sadness or madness incarnate. Is Zooks Phil's boy toy? Yeah, it does seem like it. Their, ign their ignorance has resulted in horrific acts, and they infect all they touch. Be careful. Mm, okay. That's it. This is the void. Yeah, this is the void. Interesting. Oh, here we go. I took us. I took us. Uh, one one. Okay. I nailed it. Now it's time for the music machine. Or maybe this is a music machine itself. <gasps> I solved it. Solved the riddle. I wonder if this will be blue. Probably not. It is Quentin? Yes? I don't want to do this anymore. Ooh. Okay. Maybe it's time you, you accept that I'm serious about this whole thing. What does that do? What does zero do? Okay, I can do that. Ow! Hot? No, sharp. Sharp? No, that's the best way I can explain it. Soft and sharp. Um, throw that over there. Why can I why can I use a sink? Why? It's made of wood. Okay. Why? I don't understand why it's making me why I can pick stuff up. Okay, nothing. So I gotta guess I gotta turn the thing. That was the slowest walk up the stairs. Through that. Okay, now let's see. Nothing. Uh, once, yeah. This is making me nauseated. Huh. Why is this? Oh, I'm on the thing. What's happening? What's what's different? Nothing. Sharp, sharp pain. Sharp and soft pain. What's... What's going on here? This is where I started. 
Where's the person? Oh, the person's inside me. Quentin is a vengeful ghost. And we are a 13-year-old girl. Apparently, we accused the Quentin of, like, molesting us so our daddy can uh, pay attention to us. And so our dad... Our dad killed Quentin. And now we're, like, haunted by... Uh, by him. Hey! What's happening here? This, this game's not helping me. Oh dear, yes. Indeed, oh dears. So you know what? Game, please. Where is this? Where's the ending? I need I need the ending so I can stop playing this. It's like useful or not useful but hmm I have no idea no idea what do? All I have is a key, a crowbar. Oh god, do I have to like throw 30s? Throw this. Okay, move it. That's something. Eh. There's a thing, a meter. Uh huh. Hey, where is it? Okay. It seems like it's all wood, though. Oh, God, please. Yes, I know. Maybe if I can, uh... Oops. God. No, I don't want to examine that. Not again. Any ideas? Because I have none. No ideas. Let me just throw this at this. Um, 
nothing. Unless I was to like be on this thing. No, of course not. But get out of here. There's so much junk in here. Go over there. Is there some way to chat with a ghost? Uh, not really, no. What is our... Hold on. Interact. <sighs> nope. Can't really talk to him, I don't think. He doesn't give you hints. like a piece of paper somewhere. Examine stakes. Is that blood? No. They're perfectly clean, Healy. Yeah, he only talks to you when you examine shit. Thanks, roll. Ah! Let's press the button. What did that do? Nothing. Okay. Thank you, kindly. Oh, yeah, welcome back. I like open the door somehow. And I swear to god the sink might the sink better not be involved with this. Turn that off. Maybe I do have to use a sink. Ah! Aha! Aha! There's... There's... This. Which... I don't know. Oh god. Okay. Okay, I gotta not. I just gotta close my eyes for the rain for the remainder. Here we go. Now we're getting somewhere, I think. Close my eyes.
another switch, perhaps? Oh my god. Well, I think this is what we've been looking for. It's horrible. Yeah. I just need I just to find someone to operate it. Quentin? Yes? I'm sorry. Okay. About what I, what I did, I'm sorry. I said okay. <sighs> Excuse me. Doesn't it matter? No. Dang. You fucking ruined his life, girl. Eww. Let me see what else is in here. They're resting covered in dried blood. They're all made of rotting wood. That's up there, yeah. Okay. Ugh, I am. Why am I so slow? You see this movie? Who hasn't? Oh, that's that was just the can I used. Oh, oh this is over soon because I'm about to barf. Back here again. What the hell? I thought these those took us back to that church place. Yeah, so did I. <sighs> I am very broken out in the sweat. <laughs> I have a total eclipse of the heart in my head. Which is weird. When you get tired of this. Oh yeah, I just found that I do have skulls of the Shogun. Like on Steam. I was like, hey, this is what Luna was playing. But I never installed it, so. <laughs> I mean, are you going to stream it, or... What's the haps? That was nothing, yeah. Oops. Oh god. I can't. I can't do this. Unless I go back over there, too, but... Let's try again. There's a tree over here. It looks like it's part of the ground. Yes, it is. Looks like it's from a single piece of iron. What? Iron trees. Tiny scratches? Yes, this is, I read the part though. What was in here? Nothing? Nothing. <sighs> in your th yes. I am hitting your throat with a hockey stick. Okay, so the thing was over here. <laughs> hey, Lucille. There's even pirates raiding, riding parrots. What does that even mean? Oh god, what's going on here? Oh god, this is weird. 
Everything's all glitchy. And you are back. We... I... need help. Explain. We can't get out. The portals, they keep, um... They keep kicking us back to different places. I see. It seems you're trapped then. Trapped? Likely the Spindlemen have felt you from afar and they're closing the world around you like a cage. Oh. Soon they will find you. The Spindlemen are physically weak, but they can certainly overpower a young girl. They will drag you back- they will drag you to the music machine, and they will play terrible sonatas with your body. Interesting. Is there a way out? Yes, kill them. Kill them. Then the trap will spring open. Their creations will begin to crumble, and you will be thrown back to your world. They will finally reap the, ra the wages of sin. And that <laughs> that's the worst mixed metaphor I've ever heard. What I give for a belt sander right now. Okay. How do I kill him? You don't. I'm in control, remember? Hmm. Spirits, I cannot hear you, but I can feel you. I know what you're doing, and you don't have to do it. Creation is more than shadows and mechanisms. Creation is full of the terrible and the wonderful, the known and the infinitely unknowable, the hellish corners and the heavenly peaks. Even in death, you have barely scratched its surface, and in your cynicism, uh, you are more ignorant than you think. Haley, tell voice to go masturbate with, with a cheese grater. Okay. Quentin, you shut up too. Let's go. No, I want to talk to voice. You want to play Sonata with my body? Gross. That's just gross. Oh god. Oh god, I'm scared. Oh god, why am I so scared now? <laughs> why am I so spooked? Ow. Oh, yeah, I already Yeah, I already know that. I already know the lady. I mean, you're not a lady, you're a girl. Yeah, we're back again here, but I don't know. Full on. Turn that off. Press that. That's up. Okay. that again. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Good. Hey. We're here once more. We already, we already talked about this. Hey, what's actually this, though? Looks like a strange microphone. Oh, for your screams, probably. Uh oh. I don't want to miss that. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Soft and sharp, yeah. I'll let you guys know if I'm, my mouth is watery. Because <laughs> I will mean I'm going to barf pretty soon. Huh? Oh god, what's this? I don't remember this. Quentin? There's something here. Oh god. Quentin, shh, quiet. Quentin, please. 
Quiet, I'm thinking. Oh, God. Damn it, he didn't stop fighting me. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I don't want to deal with this. You're not. You're, you're not. Oh, shit. Shut the hell up. There's a thing here. What is it? Without ears, they cannot hear. Without eyes, they cannot see. But they can sense. Don't let, do not let their inaction fool you. They know you are here. They're simply deciding how to catch you. This weapon is a gift, spirit. Pull the trigger. Fix your mistakes. Huh. Oh god. Okay. Fuck it. Let's do some tar target shooting for old time's sakes. What? Oh god, where? Oh god. Oh god, okay. Oh my god, I can't. I can't handle this. Uh, uh, what? Hmm? Hmm? What is this? I know it is truth, said Hector. What is truth? Besides, merely of the wind. Wait, merely the whim of rulers. This is how he taught, sitting in his hovel, writing his religious papers, saying that he alone remembers, he rules us. Oh my god. Your, your memory is flawed, he says. And I admit that I went mad for some time. We all did. I admit, too, that, same, that some of the past is just a feverish mist. Nightmare worlds and whispers and terrible needle-like men. I don't remember everything, but I remember enough. Hector and I, we are very like... Once I might have lied as he lies. Perhaps I did, but no more. I leave this note for posterity. <sighs> okay. This land is not heaven, but hell. A pathetic shadow of our true home. <gasps> Demons forged it, and thus it will crumble and dry and flood and perish. Beware the moon and what lies within. Trust the lurking beast. Do not trust the moon sliver. Do not fear the scratches of the night, for they are your salvation. My name is Roger, and that is the truth. Oh god, there's more to- Why is there more to this? I just want to be done. I just want to be done. Over. I want to be over. I got a gun. to learn. Yes, I know this. Are we done here? I feel like we're done here. Is there an ending to this? Let me... I think I remember this one. <laughs> but there's like no ending. Oh, I'm confused. I'm confessed. I don't. I don't know what to do anymore. There better be an ending. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> Done by whom? Don't worry about it, boy. A girl. See, I already did all these, and I did this. Let me... Let me find out. Also, sorry about this. Oh, apparently the music machine was an American psychedelic rock band. Active between 1965 and 1969. Mm-hmm. Oh, the moon sliver is actually a game too. Weird.
Hmm. Is there an ending? I don't know. I don't know what else. Huh. Huh. Also, hi guys. The Steve synopsis sounds sleepy. I guess so. Ugh. What is this? This doesn't help me. Feet hurt. Hmm. There is no. <laughs> okay, never mind. Let's just figure this out, I guess. Farm pigs and snake, or smoke, was the red place, right? Yeah, it was the red place. The place with the sun. Nothing. Or wait, maybe I should go to the void again. Machine one one ten. Okay, ten one one one. useful what but I already had that was that was that was this paper though you have a cream for her eyeballs what wait a minute can't I use okay so I guess I just gotta go out then okay 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 there's nothing to do here now I could have just used my thing here. Huh? Huh? Oh. Christ. It's stuck. It's for all the newspapers. Or is it? How do I? Oh god. Already right, looking there, right? Ugh, how's it going? I'm feeling kind of gross. Oh, here we go. Hey, Meg Mac. Your balls hurt. Yeah, that joke was already done. 
<laughs> Mega Mac. You're shaking. Are you alright? You just saved my life. Who's under here? Who am I? Whose feet? Whose leg? Whose body am I touching? My foot. Oh, it's Cookie. You just saved my life. Uh huh. Not necessarily. You don't want to kill me. I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You fucking don't. Just admit it. Damn it. People aren't nice. People aren't nice little mathematical equations you can easily solve. Maybe I don't know what I want. Maybe I'm just trying to find some thread of sense in a mess of conflicting emotions. Or, here's a thought. Maybe I'm a sociopath and maybe I like playing with my food. You don't know. You don't know because people are nonsense, Haley. Stupid nonsense you can't solve. Maybe I don't understand myself, but you sure as hell don't either. The computer's so cold, the fans are blowing their cool air on you and you need a blanket. Oh man, I wish I had cool air on me. Do you love me? What? No. I don't mean sexually. I know. So why not? Do I really need to answer that? Yes. I don't love you because that's not how these things work. But I love you. You're too young to know what that means. No, I'm not. I love you. Even after the last three months. You know, it's not a nice... It's not like it's having someone else control your body. I can look past all that because, I don't know, I just can. I mean, you don't have to leave. You can stick around. You can be my imaginary friend if you want. You don't have to like me either, I guess. <laughs> Love you sexually. Well, okay, so you kind of missed it. But Haley is 12, 13 years old and, and freaking a... Quentin is 34 years old, but he's dead, and he haunts- he's like taking over Haley's body. I don't know. Just let me go. Just, you know, forgive me. That's not easy. I managed to do it. And you think I'm still a child? I think we're very different people, yeah? Well, I think you lost something when you grew up. No, Haley. I've never been a good man or, or a forgiving man. I can't. I... <sighs> I'm done talking about this. Okay, fine. So you're gonna spend your afterlife bullying a teenage girl? Yes, that's who I am. Spiteful, I like it. That being said, you can have control. You can have control back for a bit, for my benefit. After three months, I need a break. That's a start. Well, don't get any ideas. I have one already. I'm gonna find a cigarette. Then you lose a privilege, Haley. Girls your age shouldn't- Yeah, yeah, I know. Thank you. It's not for you, it's for me. And only for a bit. Right. Okay, so... So! How are we getting off this island? Oh. What is this? This is the end. And far away, beyond space and time, there was a crimson forest. The warm leaves rustled. The birds sang shrill songs. The wind turned cold. I guess GG, I guess. <laughs> For the first time, the sun began to set. Well, we killed those four guys. Ooh! Oh man, look at this! Ooh! Magusta. Oh, I can't run. Okay, whatever. This reminds me of Hero. I'll just look up.
Oh, that's the, that. That that's a petty ass game. It is petty. Petty pretty. Our eyeballs hurt. Everyone's eyeballs hurt. Thank you, music machine. What the? Why is there? Why is that weird? Okay, no. That was fun and all. Oh, we're done. The music machine by wait a game by David Siesmanski. <laughs> to up with Unity 4.6 Pro cover art by a serious crash test dedicated to Rachel Siesmanski. One one zero zero zero. Oh, this is a thing. Solo de Gloria. Soli de Gloria. Okay. Weirwoods, yeah. Except the trunks aren't white and whatnot. Is this? Oh shit, no. Can I? Well, actually, that's a that's a a secret. One one zero 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 zero. This is this it. This this doesn't. Oh, okay. I guess that was it. Skullgirls. Skull 